We build this week as tech's big tests, okay? Mm -hmm. The first one was Palo Alto. Mm -hmm. The second one, obviously the bigger one, Much NVIDIA, bigger. and that comes today. However, fail is the first test. That's the grade we're given Palo Alto, right? I mean, it was a fail. They well, failed to live up to the stock move into the print, the hype around the cyber trade. Whatever you want to say about the earnings themselves, the stock reaction speaks louder than words today. Put some words to give me some perspective here. If it was a football game, the score is 40 nothing, and they were a 10-point favorite going into the game. Why do I say that? Because fundamentally, I sat here with you yesterday, and I outlined what the earnings expectation was going to be. Beat and raise. In fact, a very strong beat and raise. Billings growth of 16%. Well, Billings growth was actually 16%. But it was the guidance. And your response to that, mm -hmm. you nailed it. You said, well, they better deliver. And that raise better be really, really big. So that's the fundamental element that we thought we were comfortable with with this company. The technicals, I said to you yesterday, you began the segment by asking me about it. I said, look, I'm concerned about the cyber names. That's why I trimmed CrowdStrike. Mm -hmm. At the end of our conversation, I said, I think this stock, meaning Palo Alto, is nearly priced for perfection. So I was highly skeptical of the technicals. I never thought I had to be skeptical of the fundamentals as well. So this was an absolute 40 to nothing blowout when they were the favorite. You see the response today. By the way, just to be clear, I own the stock personally mm -hmm. at a lower level at around 242. The index has Palo Alto in it at that same price level. Um, and personally, that would be my stop loss because you never want to trade or turn a winning trade into a losing trade. So personally, I would exit there. The index will readdress at the end of April.